What's going on everybody back in the garage for another vlog. Um, just tidying up things today. I finally picked up some engine paint and finally new bulbs to take care of that pesky uh, blown front turn signal. Um, I cut my, I completely forgot to film it today, but I was at work. I had the uh, extended piece of exhaust pipe that I took off the jet offs once I put the muffler back on. And I cut it and trimmed it up today and sanded it. So it came out pretty nice. So let's see. In my book bag here. Where is it? Where is it? Okay. There we go. There we go. There it is. You guys can get it. Boom. That's gonna, let me get some light on it. That's gonna be the new exhaust tip for now. If you can see, it's gonna stick out of the tail section of the bumper like that. So I put a little bit of an angle on it, sanded the edges, rounded them off. So what I'm gonna do is, this is gonna go in the muffler part here. It's just gonna go up and stick out the bottom of the tailpipe. Um, what I'm going to do is just scuff the whole thing, paint it satin black for now. Um, that's half of the idea I kind of wanted for my exhaust tips, but I still have a plan for those, for the legit ones I'm going to put on the cart because I think I'm going to do dual, dual threes, I think will fit back there. I'm going to do that, but in the meantime, let's get this one painted for simply clean. Work of art. All right. Hopefully it doesn't fall over when I'm um, spraying it because that would be bad. Just lightly missed it. On the inside. And the outside. Probably end up doing three to four coats possibly on this. You want that first coat to be real light. Just a real mist. And that's it for now. Coat one, done. I don't know if you guys ever have this issue where you're working in your garage and then people drive by and it's like they're nosy. They want to they want to slow down really slow just to see what you're doing. Like <sighs> I don't know, it just gets annoying after a while when people just wanna just, they slow down to like five miles an hour to see exactly what you're doing inside your garage. Like, dang man, how about some privacy? That's why I can't really wait till, you know, we'll probably think about moving. Once we move, that way I can have like a workshop in the back of a house, hopefully. That way I can do stuff without people just being freaking nosy. So annoying, I mean, annoying, annoying. I forgot to do this yesterday. I forgot to get to the cylinder kit. Let me get this off of here. I forget. That way, that way. So this is the new tumbler kit. Some random hardware pieces. I'm gonna have to make this uh, brand new key lock cylinder out of these. Those are those pieces. I think so the tumblers. They're in here somewhere. I don't know. I gotta go through it and look. Because I have to give this back to Mr. Mark. That's simply clean. So I'll go through. 
tonight if I don't get to it today and piece together my lock kit for the car that way that way I'll be able to lock the doors and open them not that I keep anything in the car anyways and I'm not really scared if somebody takes the car because what are you gonna do you're gonna part it out I know more of my parts and they're painted a color that no other car is painted so we end it okay guys so I did the drawing for the pedals a few days ago and the guy that I picked I messaged him the only way I could message him was on YouTube and he didn't hit me back it's been four days I think that's long enough so this is what I'm gonna do to make sure that the subscriber who wins is actually watching the videos I want everybody who watches this video to just comment below with your name comment down below with your name and that way I'll know you're watching the videos and what I'll do is I'll take all those that comment down below on this video I'll put those names in a hat and pull a winner out of those names problem is sometimes with YouTube which I found out recently sometimes they automatically subscribe people to channels that they may like and it per that person may not be you know watching the channel might not be watching the videos and that's not a big deal but if I pick a winner and they don't ever watch the video to see that they won or respond maybe they're not on YouTube anymore or they lost access for whatever the reason may be I want the pedals to go to somebody who's gonna actually use them and that follows and watches and supports the channel UPS drivers going by so in this video what I want you to do is comment your name down below in the comments and I'll pick from those that comment if it's four people then it's four people if it's all 500 then it's all 500 but that lets me know that you watch the video and that you're actually going to respond if you get picked to be the winner so once again these are the pedals comment down below and from those names I'll pick a winner Weird, the uh, sky has this weird orange glow to it. Happens every so often, but uh, it's real ominous tonight. It's kind of weird. Everything is just like orange. All right. Front lip and splitter are back together and they are perfectly dry. That's gonna sit. Once this flashes, this is gonna look dope. I know you guys can't really see too much right now, but I'm just gonna let that sit there and dry. You can see what the color's gonna be like. Just a real satin black. Perfect for what I'm looking for. Um, I think, I'm pretty sure that's it. That's it, I'm gonna go inside now. Let the exhaust, the tailpipe section dry overnight tomorrow I'll put it in and now I'm gonna mess with the key locks to see if I can get one to work oh I should put the I'll deal with the book tomorrow not a big deal but um yeah I'm gonna do the uh, key cylinders now I don't think this is going to work because this piece should hook into here and this is what turns the lock in the car and it doesn't fit so what i'll probably do is i'll still go through and get all the four tumblers into the cylinder and then just keep it until i can find a piece like this that will fit these are the springs that have to go in as well well the key lock thing turned out to be a no go. Um, yeah, not really worried about it too much. Anyway, so this weekend we have Simply Clean. I will be out there Friday, Saturday for the event. Friday is the pre meet at BC Racing. Um, yeah, we'll be out there. Um, hopefully, 
Christian's car makes it. If not, you'll probably be riding with me. Maybe, I'm not sure. And then the event Saturday, all day, we'll be there working the event. So if you see us, you know, say what's up. And then Sunday brunch, Mr. Euro's Mimosa Conference 6 is at Finn's on the beach. Going to attend that. And then after that, we have um, a birthday party to go to afterwards. So busy weekend, gonna be in Daytona, Deltona pretty much all weekend. Um, that's it, car's pretty much ready to go. I'm just gonna pack everything up that I need to pack up. Probably tomorrow, we get it ready. Friday, we'll be heading out there after work hours. Hopefully, we get no traffic. So, if I see you, I see you. And if I don't, I'll see you next time in the garage. Peace.